Neuroblastoma is a cancer that grows off the adrenal gland of the kidney and it's very aggressive. It's the most aggressive type of childhood cancer um, and it spreads very quickly. Elijah is shy but outgoing at the same time. He's very loving and tender-hearted. He loves animals of every kind. This is the cat we got when um, Elijah was in treatment. I'm going to be a vet. One weekend we were out shopping. Elijah would not get out of his stroller, and he hated his stroller. So we ended up taking him to Scottish Rite. They did an ultrasound of his abdomen, and the ultrasound tech said, um, as a mom, I just want to let you know that I see something around his kidney. I didn't know anything about neuroblastoma. I had never even heard of it, and I never even once thought that my child would ever have cancer. Frequently, Elijah comes in for CAT scans of his abdomen. When we hear neuroblastoma, our hearts sink because the outcome is typically not good. His original tumor was around his kidney and it filled his whole abdomen and it wrapped around his aorta. Each arm had a spot and each of his legs had a spot in the bones. They said the survival was about 20%. I remember just crying. Why did my child have to get sick? We were just asking like, what can we do? We were ready to throw everything at the disease that we could and wanted him to fight with everything that he had. He ended up having six rounds of chemo. He had a four and a half hour surgery to remove the tumor. He had 12 rounds of radiation, two stem cell transplants. I consider Elijah a miracle child because he hasn't had a lot of the same side effects that you can see with the chemotherapy. He hasn't had any of them. He never had any infections, like he was perfect. <laughs> In April of this year, he just ended all treatment, and he's been clear for three and a half years. Children's was great. Um, his nurses were great. The doctors were amazing. Anytime overnight he would have a fever, we would call and get a response within minutes. <laughs> we know that he's a definite miracle child. Now, you can never even tell what he's been through. He's a normal five-year-old. He still has a road ahead of him, but it is just very encouraging to see how far he has come. When you go home chanting a Rocky song with your arms in the air and another one made it is very rewarding. My only hope for him is that he remains cancer-free and he can follow all his dreams. Yes, we were meant to have a miracle child and Elijah will have a huge story to tell when he's older.